Hi there, it's Steve Anderson here from the Review Web Prosperity website and this video is about how to stop your videos that you embed onto your website and blogs from playing automatically. And there's a reason why we want to do that because uh, particularly with a blog you may have a list of multiple posts on one page and if you've got multiple videos it could be quite a distraction for visitors when they turn up and all of a sudden two or three or four videos all start start playing at once. This is certainly something that you don't want to put your visitors through. Uh, another thing to consider is that people are sometimes in an office or in an environment where they don't really want uh, to be watching video or listening to audio or at least they want the choice to be able to play that um, at their own discretion. So uh, it can be quite annoying when you're in an area where um, you are not supposed to be watching video say a work office and all of a sudden you come to a website and the video starts playing automatically. I know for me the first thing I do is hit the back button as quickly as I possibly can if I'm in an environment where I don't want a uh, video to be playing on a website. So you don't want to upset your, video, uh, your visitors like that and that's one of the little catches with the web prosperity uh, video uh, functionality uh, as you'll see here. As I refresh that page this will just start playing automatically and there's a very easy fix for that and I'm going to show you how to do it. So let's go over to my web prosperity review uh, WordPress blog and I'm going to go into manage I'm going to find the post where that video is and you'll see when I come into here there's actually two options as the visual and the HTML uh, view when you're pasting the code for your video it must be in the HTML view and you will want to publish it in that same view if you change back to the visual sometimes what that can do is break the code and uh, you'll end up with spaces here and there in the actual video code and that uh, messes up your video so keep it in the HTML um, what you're going to find here is object in this code as you uh, scroll down this is the video code from web prosperity as we come down here what you're going to find is there is a little bit of code that says autoplay equals one basically what this is doing is it's telling this video player to play once automatically when someone lands on this web page um, so if you change that to naught or zero then it's not going to happen for you so you will have to do that twice you'll find that there's another autoplay uh, equals one a little bit further down once you've done both of those and click save what's going to happen I'll come back to this website and click on refresh and now what you're going to see is just a black screen with a play button rather than the image that um, web prosperity was showing up before so they may actually change this where you have the option to have autoplay or not autoplay and still upload a thumbnail image to the video player which would be really handy and I'm sure as they go along things like that will start to work out but for now that's how you get around that little problem it's a very easy fix just those two little bits of code um, and also um, if you're wanting to get more updates uh, of these little tips and tricks as far as using the web prosperity systems then you can simply click on this uh, image here where it says click here for latest news and you can opt into my newsletter where every time I make an update on my website then you'll be notified of any little uh, tips and tricks that I'm putting putting out so I've been Steve Anderson from the review-webprosperity.com website and I look forward to bringing you more tips and tricks in the near future.